All right. So, things to note. The hair. My hair has <laughs> changed. Yes. Um, I did it myself. So if any of you bitches see any unevenness, I don't want to hear it. We don't see it, okay? I had a mental breakdown, and I did it. And if it looks weird, don't tell me. Mm. That message got lost in the mail. But if it looks good, then sound off in the comments below, guys. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> If it looks bad, though, uh, shh, shh, if it looks bad, uh, we'll shadow ban you. <laughs> <laughs> then you will be blocked. <laughs> I think I'm yelling into the mic. <laughs> yeah, it's fine. It's fine. The, the way you process the audio is. Mm -hmm. All right, so we're going to be watching this video. Came Un out the unimportant ago. part. Yeah, 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 yeah. yeah. Let, yeah. Me, let me. We're going to be watching I Did a Thing video. Came out three days ago. I love these videos. Bitch, it is still not wearing shoes. Yeah. Consistency. Did, is, did that one work? Did we put that one on our channel? I'm gonna be honest. I have no fucking idea. <laughs> so uh, let me let, let me look. Hold on. Let me look. We'll cut this. We'll cut this. <laughs> Gotta be honest. Don't ask me. <laughs> I got no idea. Hold on. Oh, analytic content. Here we go. Nope. Don't think that made it. No, 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 no. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, we did. We did. Got 17 views. <laughs> I thought that was Michael Reeves. No, no, no. This was this was him. What? Because Michael Reeves did another boxing robot, but it was like, it, this, this is oh yeah. oh yeah. This is a butt plug one. I didn't realize that the boxing device <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. was so big. Yeah, yeah. Such a big. Okay. Anyway, yes. All right. Yeah, yeah. We did. So we did put we did put one of his videos on our channel before. So Donna has seen his channel. Mm -hmm. Not this video though. Okay. This is a good video. I've seen this video. Oh, you have? Okay. It's, why? Just wait. I want to see it again. I, okay. It came out and I was like, uh, let's watch a let's watch a video today. And then you were like, no, I don't feel like doing okay. it today. Okay, shh, 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 shh. <laughs> no guilt tripping. All right, all right. Let's go. How you going? This <laughs> is my mate's house. <laughs> this is going on. He's yeah. like yelling into all of my orifices. <laughs> okay, okay, okay. How you going? This is my mate's house, which, as you can see, doesn't work very well. And he doesn't know who burnt his house down. Police are tonight hunting an arsonist who targeted the home of controversial, friendly Geordie's YouTube blogger. But I promised to help him by making a terrifying security system which would prevent anyone from coming near his house. Can I be honest, hot take? Yeah. Arson is such a funny crime. <laughs> like whenever what do you mean? someone says arson, I, I can't help but to giggle. I don't know. Oh, I think that's you. <laughs> okay. I don't think that's I think a that, like, hearing type. a shooting is like, aw. But I hear arson, because some people name their kids arson. I think it's because we live in America, and we're just... <laughs> <laughs> we're just... I'm like, we that just don't happened understand. in the White House. This is, like, a <laughs> We just don't understand. <laughs> no. Our, <laughs> this is terrible, but, like, yeah. we have shootings every day. <laughs> I was like... Hey. We're desensitized. But, like... But I don't know. Burning down a building is just such like girly thing, you know? Like a girl's Try night harder. out. <laughs> Bomb the building next time. Okay. <laughs> We're gonna be put on a list after this. Okay. We're like, right. I heard I was on a watch list. I'm gonna go get my watch right now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Thank you. <laughs> House ever again. <laughs> It was just a, it was a hard time. From coming near his house ever again. I thought that was still his house, but the damn bitch didn't burn down that bad. Now, I've always wanted to make a horrible home security system, and Jordan's house getting burnt down was actually just a great excuse for me to pretend I'm helping by making something I was going to make anyway. So that was real. His house really did get burnt down. Yeah, he got firebombed. I feel like fire and bomb are kind of, you know, the well, same. Well, they throw, like, a, a thing that has fire in it, and it... <sighs> Do... Is he controversial? Like, is he some, like, weird Alex uh, Jones? I think they'll of... explain it, and no. Okay. A face-tracking paintball turret. You don't get And to start this build, I did what I always do, and went online and just found someone that had already made it, this child. I then no. stole their design and code without giving them any credit. <laughs> Now the child is using two motors to move the Nerf turret up and down and side to side. And I reckon if I just upgrade the motors and wooden frame, it should work in the same way, even with a much heavier paintball turret. 
And to do this, I bought a much more expensive material. The children. Where did my water go? Is it is it near you? You lost the right. You laughed at Arson. Oh, Remember that is, one time is, you did is, that? Alright. Okay, go back. can't get there. I'll just using two motors to move the nerf turret up and down and side to side. And I reckon if I just upgrade the motors and wooden frame, it should work in the same way, even with a much heavier paintball turret. And to do this, I bought a much more expensive material that children can't get their hands on. Meth, which I pressed into white sheets. Then I took it to my only mate that hasn't had his house burnt down yet and used his custom built CNC machine to cut out the frame. Hands and feet. Uh, ew, 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 ew. Wait, what? what did you say? I said hands and feet clear. Oh, wait. Did they put that on there or did... I have no idea. Because that's really good. I don't like watching that. <laughs> yeah, you have a thing against feet, don't you? Yeah, I'm a foot And while the machine is doing all the work, feet. I'll tell you about Jordan's place being burnt down. Yes. Jordan, or Friendly Geordies, makes videos oh, about... his name is even Friendly Geordies? Why do you want to burn his house down? <laughs> I'll, I'll explain, I'll okay, explain. but it's, it's like... Being burnt down. Jordan, or Friendly Geordies, makes videos about Australian politics, a lot of the times about corruption within the government. And as you would expect, this has pissed quite a lot of really powerful people off. And recently, he spoke to a whistleblower named Troy, who revealed the extent of money laundering that happens in Australian clubs on poker machines, and how the people that are meant to regulate this choose to ignore it. And we actually demonstrated this by laundering $25,000 in a single day with Jordan. But after Jordan spoke to this whistleblower, his house mysteriously got firebombed, and that meant that Jordan had to go into hiding. But now Jordan's back, and just released a video explaining what happened and who he thinks might be responsible. So you should go check that video out after this. But this also means he definitely needs security and what- Wait, so he's good. Yeah. He's the hero of the story. Yes. Okay, poor guy, I feel bad. Yeah. Like just a girly arson, but I still, you know. Yeah, I still suck that the house got burned down. Yeah, I hope that he wasn't in it or like he had, that would suck if you had animals. I'd go full John Wick. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, but without the guns, cause they don't have those in Australia. Do they have those weird, dull knives? I don't know. Well, they do got fire, so... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh. <laughs> Why would you rely on police when you have me? Am I able to just pull these off now? Yeah. No. If you're able to. I'm not strong. Yeah, it okay, once the pieces were all cut out, I put them together. This bearing in here, this servo on the bottom, which will move the base around, this one on the side for the up and down motion, this Arduino, these bolts on the bottom so I don't have to use any glue, then I screwed in this arm, and then put a leg on the other, and then finished it off with a little bit of hot oh glue God. to stop it creaking. So I don't, be honest, don't, so I don't have to glue it and then use his oh. glue. <laughs> oh. Have you ever done that before? Like you're using hot glue and then you touch it or you get some on you and it's just like incredibly hot. <laughs> To be honest, I think I've done that, but I'm just built so different that it kind of, you know that pain that kind of feels good? Where you're no. like, oh. No, I don't. Well, then let's carry on. <laughs> now, with this Arduino, <laughs> I have we'll no idea how to write code for it. But Probably luckily, I don't have to, as the child's code should work on this in exactly the same way. So, I opened up my computer, which of course has Opera GX on it, the sponsor oh, of today's video. Do we Thanks, watch the ad? Okay, so we <laughs> did have a comment last time. I didn't respond to it. I don't really mind watching the ads. I hate ads. I'm trying to shift blame to Elijah. I, it's, it's, the blame is shifted. I hate ads. Oh, look, it's a video we watched that we couldn't post. And there's the video that we watched that we could post. Okay. <laughs> they cannot see what you're pointing to. They have no idea. Uh, wait, wait, wait. If, if I put this here, then the one on this side is the one that we posted. The one in the middle. I hope you look so stupid and that doesn't work. <laughs> Either way, you look fucking dumb. All right. Anyway. Anyway. Uh, what? Well, yes. I don't mind watching ads. I don't typically do it in my regular YouTube viewing. I skip. I cannot. I cannot watch it. This ad, we're skipping this ad. No, we're not. This ad is going to be boring. It's just Upper GX. Hate Upper GX. Love Firefox. Elijah, you're being a hater. I'm going to need you to stop. Well, Firefox is... Upper GX is just based on Chromium. It's just well, Chrome, but Well, people wanted us to do it, Elijah. You got Yeah, but they wanted us to do it for Seth's videos. We'll do it for Seth's videos. So what we're going to do is we're going to watch Wait, who the video. fuck is this? This is... What do you mean? This is not Seth. This is... Uh, I did a thing. Seth is... 
Okay. I am not keeping up with the lore very well. We're not watching this one. Oh, no, I remember. Okay, yeah. can you cut that? Because I feel like an idiot. No, He's the part where in. you're dumb. But like, no, <laughs> sorry. Let's go. This is all going in. Uncut. What if this is a really funny ad now and you look like the villain? Well, we won't know because I'm going to skip it. I'm <laughs> anyway. Open. It's all on and you. Custom update. coin, which in the works link to download like Opera GX to today. Okay, back to the kids code, which works by communicating to this webcam here from the 90s, which is connected to the Arduino, and then these two servo motors, which work together to move the webcam so it points directly at a person's face. I am gonna be honest, all the shit that he said, I was thinking like, <laughs> Arduino sounds fucking stupid. <laughs> Of course you I had of no course. idea what he was saying. <laughs> right. I was like, Arduino stones, are you having a lisp? Massive penis. <laughs> I hate whenever people joke like <laughs> For that joke know. so much. <laughs> I don't like thinking about people's cocks in their cars. Okay, alright, alright. That joke is not going to make any sense if they couldn't hear that. If they just couldn't oh, hear you're the just car talking about by. some random guy's cock <laughs> being really big. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You'll have to add in like a really loud car noise. <laughs> <laughs> you're a helicopter. <laughs> it's finding me. Oh. Okay, let's see if I move to the side. Also, I'm so sorry to pause it so soon. I feel like if a like a criminal came to rob someone's house and they had all this weird shit, yeah. I'd be like not gonna do this anymore <laughs> i've been changed. you open the house and it's like a machete ceiling fan yeah, like i think i would just i would reform that would be yeah i don't need to be here anymore. i don't need to do this anymore i think i've had enough this is terrifying it finds my face so well That's... what about down here I really don't like it. It's so unnerving. The noise it's making. <laughs> and then when your face touches the crosshair in the middle, the servo attached to the trigger fires. And it seems to find my face pretty well, but sometimes it gets confused by my wrinkly knees, thinking they are a face. <laughs> Cover them up! The Cover up the dogs! Knees. Just my knee, not a face. Or even my face-shaped penis. It's pointing directly at my cock. That's terrifying. <laughs> and now that the machine wants to kill me, it's time to give it a gun. And I bought this one, which looks pretty cool. And because of Australia's strict gun laws, it also has the added bonus of sending you to prison if you put this barrel attachment on, which makes it look too much like a real gun. <laughs> Alexa. That is what makes it look like a real yeah. gun. Not yeah, all yeah. the other things. No, no, no. no. Just the. Oh, just, just yeah, because that before part then, I was like getting confused. I was like, what am I yeah, looking at? Yeah, I would have known at? immediately that that wasn't a gun. I was like, ooga, ooga, ooga. Like, what is? what am I looking at? It's like abstract art. <laughs> this barrel attachment, but that, on, which I'm makes like, it look too much like a real gun. Not. Wait, like, Alexa, do you reckon you can put this? Oh, he's fine. He's not dead. On the end of this? Yeah, it's just that way, just help me push it. I just can't do it because I got a camera in my hand. Yeah, push. <laughs> and just hold all of it. Yep. And the plan is to attach uh, it up here on these arms. But I completely forgot about the gas tank, so hopefully it's weighted evenly and isn't too heavy for these servos. But I'm hopeful, as these servos have 33 kilos of torque, or in American units, enough power for half a school shooting, which should be more than enough. And this looks pretty intimidating when all together. This is terrifying. I definitely don't think- Again, if I saw this shit whenever I was robbing a house, I'd be like, what military officer did I It's just... like, it, it's it's tracking you when you open the door, like, no, I don't Yeah, no, I'm, I'm pizza delivery man, sorry. I feel like firebombing my own house. So time to see if the face tracking still works with the gun and gas tank on the end. Oh, Alexa, do you reckon you can look up and tell me if this this works? Just look into this and we'll see if it finds your face. Just, yeah, just keep looking there. Oh. They were born to be Americans. I'm sorry, but they gotta have a little bit of red blood Why is it shooting? In them. And even though it was firing blanks, it's still terrifying and is loud and my ears are ringing. So it's time to test it out with some real paintballs. But there's a problem. This is also illegal. Like, very 
illegal. If I put a ball in the turret and shoot it in my house, the police will come and give me a $100,000 fine, put me in prison, and then touch me, which is not what you want from a home security system. But my logic is, if you are actually defending yourself from a person wanting to firebomb you and potentially kill you, then this would be considered self-defense and must stand up in court. So just to be safe, I found a paintball venue crazy enough to let me legally test this device on their premises. Wait, is this canon? Like, is that really I, I would trust him. So, okay. I don't paintball. No. But those... They won't like kill you. They'll bruise you, right? Yeah, they'll hurt. But it won't. It won't stop an intruder. No. Well, I mean, it'd stop stop intruders. It stopped me for sure. Yeah. Hell yeah! I, I wouldn't keep going. <laughs> I'm a fucking pussy, but I'd assume if see if I was an intruder and I started getting shot by that, I'd be like, oh, they know I'm here now, so I better leave. But it, so it's more of the fear rather than the ouchie. Well, I mean, it still hurts. But it's it won't make you bleed. It can make you bleed. But it won't Give like me a it reference. won't kill you. It won't. They'll kill show you. you. They'll show it in the video. Okay, but like this is real Australia. I think so. I'm not gonna look it up. I'm gonna trust him wholeheartedly. So if I'm wrong, <laughs> then it's his fault. Yeah, I'm not looking into Australia. No. Yeah. Don't exist. Spitfire paintball. Oh, now, they said they didn't want to be in the video if I get in trouble with the police, but I won't actually find that out until after the video is released. So, Spitfire Paintball, everyone. Hello, everybody. Hello. Hey, how's it going? How you going? Pretty good. I'm excited. Are, are you uh, proud of this contraption? Do you think that it's going to protect you? I think it's definitely going to protect you as long as you don't look at it. Like you, because it's face yeah. yeah. You just always have to be looking away. Oh, and okay, then you're so going to be safe. So you're not programming in the faces of the enemies that you want. It's just any face. <laughs> any face. <laughs> any face. <laughs> <laughs> and then you'll be fine. You just can't look at it. <laughs> How good do you think he is of a programmer? He, he can't do any of this. Also, it's, <laughs> it's all faces. Also, I didn't write this code. I stole it from a child on YouTube that, that made this for a Nerf gun. <laughs> but sadly, the owner did have one condition, and we needed to wear masks to prevent us from getting shot in the eyes, which means the facial recognition won't work. So the plan now is to get Jordan, his producer Christo, Alexa and I to all wear shirts with the faces of people that might have a reason to burn down Jordan's house. <laughs> oh, that way we can also oh test if they're inhumane. Wait, liberal is bad. I have no idea. Okay, we're I don't know. into that one faces are even recognized by the computer as real faces and also means we get shot in the chest so time for the first real test American which I decided to do as a matador <laughs> <laughs> And that seemed to work really well, and it was searching for real faces to shoot. So I put on one of the face shirts and got in front of the turret. <laughs> And that hurt so much more than I thought it would. Maybe it was the rubber balls on bare skin or the fear factor of the autonomous robot, but I do not remember paintball hurting this much. Okay. Yeah. Sorry to keep pausing. Just because I don't understand paintball. People uh -huh. are usually wearing suits and stuff, right? Whenever they like play. Like a shirt. But are they wearing like no. thicker clothes? They just get shot like this and they get bruised up and that's yeah. fun. I mean, they wear clothes that they don't care getting paint on. But, like, with the bruising and stuff, do they wear any sort of, like... You can. A lot of people don't. It's not required, I don't think. The only thing that's required is the face mask. So why do... Like, I'm sorry. Just me being a little, like, bitch, I guess, that yeah. doesn't particular. Like, if I could do this or laser gun, I'm gonna choose a fucking laser gun. Well, it's because with this, it's... I don't know. 
the the actual projectile go, you know, it's like it goes pew pew. Yeah, yeah, that's the fun okay. part. Okay. <laughs> In America, we just shoot people with real guns. <laughs> shit. I don't know anything about this shit. So the rest of the boys gave it a go. Okay. And Christo seemed quite calm and managed to face the turret directly. Oh, it's not turning. But for some reason, the robot ignored the face on his shirt and decided to kneecap Christo instead. Try to shoot your knee. Why did it kneecap you? Before shooting Alexa directly in the face. Oh, careful, Alexa! Careful! Careful! It's gone wrong. Oh <laughs> then it was Jordan's turn with the Gladys Berejiklian face. And the robot, for some reason, really struggled to recognize her as a human. But eventually, it worked. <laughs> and as you can see, it's actually quite hard to get hit. And to get the turret to actually shoot us, we had to flatten our shirts and walk very slowly towards the camera which luckily is what most criminals are known to do before burning down people's houses. <laughs> Why are you so wilty? And after comparing our battle wounds, of which Christo had the most, we decided to Wait, run through a scenario. Face. Jordan would lie down sleeping like he normally would at home, and we would try to sneak up to him with a petrol can and burn him alive. So now, enjoy Alexa, Christo and I being tortured. And I was hit first, but luckily my apron stopped me from feeling anything. And that almost seemed to piss off the turret, and it decided to aim lower, and once again, kneecapped Christo. <laughs> and the turret was working really well this time, as we were moving around and jumping in front of the crosshair a lot. but mostly it actually just traumatized us so much that we didn't want to go anywhere near it. Like but fortunately for us, it crashed. So we took the opportunity to pour petrol all over Jordan, killing him. And then to make it worse, just as his cameraman was asking Jordan if the turret made him feel safe. Feel safe? No, not at all. The turret crashed and shot Jordan in the neck. <laughs> so we decided to try it one more time but just before we did i looked down at my phone and noticed 11 missed call and multiple messages from my mum letting me know that the new south wales police had showed up at her doorstep and was searching her house and I immediately thought it was because of this video I'm filming right now, but it turns out it wasn't. And they were actually there because of this video I made five years ago. And after telling the boys what was happening at my mum's house. There are police yeah. at my mum's house. I feel like I can't do anything else now. Ah! Wait, I think they're leaving. Yeah, they're leaving. Do you reckon they're leaving? They're they're leave. leave. We all decided that my mum would be fine and we should continue with another group test. But this time, we decided to split up to give us better chances. And when we did this, the turret really didn't know what to do, and it was missing a lot more. And Alexa and I managed to not get hit at all, but Christo once again stayed in one place for too long. Oh, he's getting bullied, yeah. Before Alexa snuck around and burnt Jordan. And the robot once again failed to stop us. And maybe this was because the faces were too small and kind of wrinkled and hard to detect. Oh, you got oh, some man. good ones. So we decided to give the robot a bigger target and the boys drew John Barillaro's beautiful face on me. I mean. And I don't know if you can tell by the way I'm tensing and screeching like a goblin, but this is 
terrifying. Oh my god, the way but... he just like glided across the floor was kind of fucking epic. <laughs> well, like I don't he... think it was. I think you're. By the I way, know. I'm tensing and screeching like a goblin, but like this that is part? terrifying. Mostly because my mind I'm... is trying to I'm... keep me in one spot long enough for the turret to find the face. So it looks like it's working for this video. But at the same time, my body wants to run away in the opposite direction, which resulted in me doing this strange up and down jump. I've never seen your body tense that much in my life. Really? You're like, yeah, yeah. you're like a monster. It was disgusting. <laughs> and in one way, that worked really well, and all of us have some nasty wounds. But it wasn't enough to stop us from burning Jordan alive in all three tests. But I don't think he's in a position to be picky. So I welded up a bracket and went to his new address at 109 Kirribilli <laughs> Avenue, 2061 New South Wales and installed it next to his front that door. Place yeah, I was is. like, I wonder if that's one of the politicians' houses. It's gotta be. Because that would be really funny. <laughs> it would be really Not funny. Not that... Send the police because this is super illegal to have at your house. Yeah. <laughs> door. And now, Ooh, at the bare shit. minimum, the next person that burns down his house will have some recognizable Maybe paintball hickeys on them. Thank you so much for watching. If you like that, please subscribe. So what did you think of this video? Again, I think they were born to be Americans. This is some American. <laughs> I don't know. They got some red blood in them. Yeah. Okay. So Hold on. Um, But also, on a serious note, it is like, I don't know. I always see violence as like inherently American for some reason. I don't know why. <laughs> That's us. We own that. Um, But like thinking about even anywhere someone like burning down a house for some political opinion or whatnot is insane so i feel i do genuinely feel bad for him because i'm a very sentimental person and having like my belongings i don't know how bad it was but i'm sure that it's not a good situation to be in also i'm pretty sure i'm almost certain that it was not for political well i'm pretty sure it was organized crime then for what reason would it be other than well because because he was speaking out against uh money laundering oh and criminals do that a lot oh and criminals would also firebomb a I mean, house i imagine you are inherently a criminal if you firebomb a house all right here's the uh here's the place that it says it is i don't know i have no idea i don't know either uh General, Governor General's office. Ah, uh, I'm sure that's what it is then. But who the fuck is Governor General? You don't know who the Governor General is? No. We're too uh, American, American to understand yeah. that. Something colony. Who's something. part of Parliament? I got no fucking <laughs> clue. All right, next video then. Oops, that's the end of this video. This is the outro. Yeah. Wait, wait, I'm gonna do. I'm gonna do like a transition where I pull. I pull black bars in with my hands, like, whoosh, and then it's over. <laughs>